So let's say that you want to reference one card with another. In that case, what you can simply do is utilize the card links. So let's say, for example, I want to link the scene nine with scene one. So for that, I can simply go over here and then utilize the link. Let's, so let's see how to do that. So over here in the card, I can just go around here and then go around to the share function where I have linked to car, uh, card uh, URL. So I can simply copy this out and close this right here. So once I copy that out and close this entirely, I want to link it out with scene one. So I can go to scene one and under description, let me just space this out. And what I can do is press save and you can see that that has been linked to scene nine now. So if I were to click on this, what happens is that scene nine opens up. I can also do this in between different cards of different boards. So let me just go around here. I'm just going to go around onto scene nine itself I'm going to go to uh, share and, and I'm just going to copy this around. So once I copy that around, I can go on to a different board. Let's say, for example, if I were to go to board one, add in a list right here. So I'm just going to add in test list just like this. And then I'm going to add in a card right here called test. So let me just add in a card right here and then click on test. And over here, let me just add in that link. So I'm just going to go around on the description, paste this out. And what happens is that scene nine is added in. If I were to close this, you can see that the uh, that there is an attachment over here as well. So if I were to click on this, then it goes back onto the board scene nine, just like that. What I can also do is let me just go back onto the card again from the boards onto the board one. What I'm going to do is let's say add it in as an attachment, which is another way to link up card. So I can just go around here onto attachment just like this. And then I can go to Trello and then go on onto that particular board. So you can see that there's boards right here, like two to two board over here. And then from two to two board, I can attach the entire board as well over here, or I can attach Trello. And over here, you can see that there's different cards like C9, or you can search for cards right here as well. For example, if you want to search for scene three, just like this, then you got scene three card right here. So you can just click on it and that will be attached. So you can see that attachment is there. So if I were to click on this, it goes back onto the Trello board, which we added in as an attachment. So let me just go to board back onto board one over here. And then if I were to click on this one, it goes and redirects onto the card as you can see. If you want to attach uh, or entire board as link, that can be done as well. You can simply go on to show menu and then over here, you'll be able to find the link. So you can go on to more and here's the link to board. So you can simply copy this out as well and go on to other board. Let's say for example, board one, I'm going to add in a list right here and add in a test to a uh, card just like this. And I can go on to test two. And what I can do is simply paste out the link, press save, and there you go. It has been linked onto the board and two to two board is accessible from right over here. I can also, of course, add it over here in the activity and that is there. So you can say something like, can you check this out please? And you can add in the link right here, press save and the link has been made. So you can simply click on it and it goes on to the other board just like that. So that is how you can link up cards and boards with one another inside of Trello. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.